Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another video. November has just started and you know, it's that time of the month where I show you guys 10 new apps you must have on your device. Now these apps are most of them very, very useful. And of course, some of them are just cool and you need to have them on your device. So let's get started with the first one. So if you have recently updated your device to iOS 16.1, you know that live activities are now on iOS and you can use them on your device running iOS 16.1. And this one right here adds live activities your lock screen it is called better desktop and it has a few of them so right here we'll have just like a fun one then we'll have the wage earner right there you have a countdown sunrise sunset you have the current weather you have a to-do list a quote or even just a picture that you want to select from your photo library and then if you switch to health right here we'll have everything from your health here that you can display on the dynamic island and of course on live activities on your iPhone. Now what you can do here is just select which one of them you want to actually use. So let's move to tools here. So let's say we want to enable this countdown right here. Of course, we can go ahead and edit this and even change the colors there of the background and all that. And then just tap right there. It has been applied. When we go out of there, you can see it's on the dynamic island now. And of course, if we lock the device, we have it as a live activity as well. Picture in Picture Splitware is the next app for the video. Now this one is really interesting. It utilizes the Picture in Picture feature of iOS to basically let you put anything you want on the Picture in Picture mode, like your media, bullet chat, to-do list, your browser, or timing. This is actually really cool. You can actually have like a website being displayed on the picture in picture mode so if i just go here i can browse or i can go to a file if i just want to go here to website real quick so let's just go to apple now all i have to do here if i need let's say i want to take a note or maybe do something from a website i can just go ahead and place this on the picture in picture mode you can see it works as it should of course you can resize it you can place it anywhere you want we can hide it there let's say i want to go to messages i can have the website right there pretty cool now you can do of course the same thing here with other stuff as you could see we have your media right there to do list a bullet chat anything you want you can just type it and have it on the picture in picture mode open find is the next app for the video now this app will let you find anything through the camera using text so you can type anything you want right there and then of course just point your camera it will find that text for you or you can do the same with your pictures now this is a feature that we have on iOS as well, but you have it on this app and of course it has some more features. So if we have these photos right here, we can go to photos or screenshots, they are separated and search for something. So let's just search for settings right here. You can see it will find the pictures and there we have the results. So it will just like that, find any picture you need. And if you want to delete something or favorite something, you can do it from here. And of course it will apply to your photo library as well. The next app for the video is a wallpaper app called Island Wallpaper. It offers some really beautiful wallpapers, especially if you have the newer iPhone 14 Pros and the 14 Pro Maxes, this will have some really, really nice wallpapers. So if we go right here to more under Island section, you can see these really cool wallpapers that you can get for your iPhone 14 Pro and the 14 Pro Max. Now, most of these will be free. A lot of them are also paid, but you will find a ton of them here just by browsing. You can see all these really, really cool wallpapers that actually fit really well with the Dynamic Island. Now, going back to home here, we will find also depth effect wallpapers for iOS 16. You will have different categories here. You have mountains, birds, buildings, castles, anything you want here different like sports and all that stuff so you can find some really really nice wallpapers for your lock screen now we'll have different sections here we'll have one dedicated for the iphone 14 pros and then you will have here one that will just shuffle wallpapers and show you random wallpapers for your device so if we go here and try to download this you can see it will actually download all the wallpapers that you can use to shuffle them on the lock screen of your ios 16 device with the new shuffle mode that we have on iOS 16. Boring Island is the next app for the video. This one will add some extra stuff to the dynamic island of your iPhone 14 Pro or the 14 Pro Max, like add seconds to the clock. So if we just start this, 
you can see we have a clock layer and we have seconds as well that's really cool or you can add things like this like black hole so it just it's just like a black hole it will just expand right there you can see the dynamic island that's really cool and you will have also things like a different emojis a sleepy cat overall it's just like a fun app to have if you have an iphone 14 pro or a 14 pro max dynamic notch is the next one it allows us to customize the notch of your iphone 14 pro or the 14 pro max but also all the devices as well so you will have here curated wallpapers which are wallpapers that are included with the app and you can add different effects to them to hide basically the notch but if you have the device with dynamic island you can choose this one right here so you can again go to these wallpapers or pick your own wallpaper from the photo library and once you have picked the wallpaper you can go through these like different models right here and add different effects to the wallpaper which then will add the effect to the dynamic island and you will have a few here that are free and the rest of them are actually paid so if you want to get them you will have to pay 2.99 to unlock all the different features next up is my pod now this one is really cool it will bring back the old ipod to your iphone you can see how good this looks and it works even better so right here we have the scroll wheel of course to just move around we have the music here we want to tap on that we can go to our playlists artists right here and just of course go ahead and play anything we want just like that you can see that interface and how cool that looks this is really really great what i like about this app is that it also offers a few different themes so if we just go back here and go to settings you will see theme here and if you go here you can switch between different themes like this black one you can see this all dark one or the special one with the red like scroll wheel this one is really really cool i really like this app and i've actually used a lot this app since i've downloaded it it's just really fun to have and of course it brings back old memories next up we have an app called better watch now this will be an app that's useful for you if you have an apple watch it allows you to download some really cool watch faces for your apple watch now the way it works all you have to do of course have your watch connected to your iphone once you find a watch face that you like simply tap right here to add on my watch and you're good to go you can go ahead and just choose the model that you have right here so of course it fits better tap right there choose the millimeters tap continue and you're good to go you can go ahead and add these really beautiful watch faces to your apple watch and you can see what we have right here we have the top rated at the top right there really really cool now it's halloween time you can see all those really nice you have a luxury section right here all those of course luxury brands right there and you have like different ones health tracker free picks custom calendar so you can have the calendar at all time on your apple watch you can see right here these are really really nice so you will have a bunch of like different categories here to search from of course you can go ahead and save your favorites right here and then if you go here you can actually even create your own apple watch watch faces and again you will get some really really nice looks on your apple watch with this app Skywall is the next app for the video. This is a wallpaper app that offers a lot of wallpapers and what I love about it is that the quality of the wallpapers is really really good. It has a simple interface, very easy to use. All you have to do is just from the home screen here you can just swipe like this and see all the different wallpapers that you can get for your device. Of course if you want to see a preview of how it looks on your home screen you just tap on the screen and it shows you the icons of the home screen and from here you can go back and of course go into different categories so go right there and choose the category you want and then from here you can just swipe like this and of course once you find a wallpaper that you like you can simply save it from here and last but not least is an app called day since it allows you to just track how many days have passed since something important has happened maybe an event or a birthday or whatever it is you can just go ahead and add it right here simply tap on add event and just add the details of the event right here of course the name you can choose a category right there and the date when it happened and then right here you will have 
all the events and of course it will show you how many days have passed now if you go into one of the categories you can of course see all the different categories and see all the, the events that you have on that certain category and of course you can tap right there if you want to rearrange them so that is it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video go ahead and subscribe for more videos if you enjoyed it and of course leave a like on this one and i'll see you on the next video